Monday. Okay, so we're back with a package that just arrived at my door. I'm actually really stoked because, oh, my mess was stirring my coffee. Um, both of my last two packages that are supposed to arrive are actually out for delivery today, and I thought only one would get here today. So, um, I just pulled this box in here. So I wanted to show you what we have. Um, I'm actually a little, I'm gonna close this bathroom door because a little mess in there. Um, one of the things that I ordered, I feel like it's not gonna fit in this box, but I guess we'll see if it's in there. <laughs> All right, here we go. This one is from Urban Outfitters and I was looking at this for the longest time and then they had a sale on Memorial Day or Memorial Day weekend. Oh yeah, it's in here. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I snagged two things. I'll show you the first one. Oh, it's cute. Okay. So this first one is from the wall. I don't know where exactly, um, but I just pretty oh my goodness look at it are you kidding those brain bows so beautiful Michael's probably gonna kill me because I love wall hangings especially like textured ones and he's like girl you don't need any more of those but I think I do so I got this beautiful little rainbow thing <laughs> for the walls and then this is like the real thing that I'm so excited for. Oh my God, the colors, you guys. Okay. I got a rug for in here. And just take a peek at the colors of this. I'm actually really pumped that it's like kind of thinner and just like lightweight. Oh my God. I can only do it. We're gonna open it and maybe lay it out in here. Gosh. Oh my gosh, <gasps> it's so pretty. <gasps> Look at that, the oranges, the rests. Oh. oh, it almost looks like it might be like reversible. Okay, let's look. Okay, I laid it out like on top of the bed so I can kind of start figuring out how I wanna lay it in the room. I had originally kind of thought that it'd be kind of cool to do it like at a diagonal so that more of it would like reach out. But because I was nervous that it wouldn't cover the whole bed um, long ways, but it does. Oh my gosh, is it not the most beautiful rug you've ever seen? <laughs> um, whoa, so I'm not totally sure yet. I want to lay this out. I'm probably gonna have to wait till Michael gets home so he can like lift the bed and I can play with the laying out of this thing, but oh, I'm so excited. All right, second package has arrived and we're pretty pumped because that means we can start putting this bed together tonight. So the low mattress has to, um, kind of sit and expand for 24 hours. So that has happened, which means that we get to put together the rest of this. So, okay. Oh, I'm very excited about this. Oh, yes. This is gonna be perfect. All right, this is from H&M. It is a duvet cover. And I showed you guys earlier that, or yesterday, that we grabbed a big down comforter. So this will go on top of it. And look at that color, you guys. It's like a burnt rust color. And that's gonna look so good because it matches the rug really nice. Um, and I feel like it's gonna be the perfect pop of color in here. And then, this is not bedroom related at all, but if you check out the outfit today, big T with little biker shorts, this 
is like the fit of summer. So I grabbed a like heather gray pair of little biker shorts for like seven bucks or something. They're normally I think 10, but they were on sale. So is the duvet. Um, I think the duvet was like $55. I'm so excited. We're gonna have a lot to put together tonight. Hi friends. <laughs> so next day, so today is Tuesday, um, and we've had kind of a rough day today, to be totally honest. Lots of things have just gone wrong, and I haven't had a day like this in a really long time. But, first, I'm gonna just tell you. Um, first, I shinned my shin on the bed first thing this morning. Like, giant bump. It hurt so bad still. Then, what happened next? Oh, I was going to run some errands. And I was looking for this outdoor rug from Target. And I was checking the stock online, and it said they had one in Boulder. So, well, they said they had three in Boulder. So I run over to Boulder, and I'm looking for this rug. Can't find it anywhere. Asked a couple employees. They can't find it. And I'm, <laughs> I really wanted this rug. So, like, this lady who, like, a manager looked <laughs> and still couldn't find it. So she was like, yeah, our inventory is just off. I was like, dang it. Then I go to Trader Joe's, get bomb food. But as I'm checking out, the checkout guy, I don't know what I did, but he was not happy with me. He was like throwing my food on the table and just being like really like huffy and puffy and like aggressive. And I was like, ooh. <sighs> then I run a couple more errands and I come home and I come to unload my car and I realize you see a giant ass scratch all the way across the driver's side of my car, which must have happened in the last parking lot I was in because I didn't hit anything. <sighs> then, it's not over yet, y'all. <laughs> then, um, Michael gets home, we're chilling. He decides he wants to take a nap. He like jumps backwards onto the bed, our older bed, the one that we moved into the guest bedroom, and boom, <laughs> it fell through the bed frame. And then we get an email that our dang couch we've been waiting for for so long, which was supposed to be delivered on Thursday, is now not being delivered until Monday which makes me suspicious that they're just gonna keep pushing it because they don't have any of the pieces. So I feel like it's just been a day. But it's gonna get better now. It's gonna get better. We decided we're gonna turn it around. I'm gonna go do some work on our bedroom so that hopefully we can just sleep in there tonight um, and wake up to our super cozy bedroom tomorrow morning. So we're gonna take you along with us I showed you yesterday everything that had come in. Oh, I actually need to move my laundry. Um, everything that had come in from my orders. So I'll flip you around and show you what we're working with currently and what we gotta do. All right, here is what we are working with currently. So this is the rug. I laid it on the bed yesterday, like I told you, just so I could see if it would lay straight underneath the bed and look okay, or if I want to like make it diagonal, I don't know. Diagonal will probably kill Michael. He likes things like <laughs> straight, <laughs> symmetrical. <laughs> um, I'm a little bit more eclectic, I guess you could say. <laughs> Something like that. These are our sheets. These are the new white sheets that we got from Hearth and Hand. I just washed them last night. I also washed our duvet cover. So. We are going to make the bed. We're going to get the rug set up. And bed, did you tell them that it, it's fully firmed up now and it feels so good? Yeah, I actually, I was chatting about it yesterday because we had officially hit the 24 hour mark. Yeah. Pretty pumped. Now we're at 48 hours. Yeah. We didn't do nothing yesterday. 
Yeah, we did not sleep on it. We didn't do any work in here. So um, I'm going to show you really quick what it ends up looking like. We still have some work to do as far as like decorating. Um, we'll see if we can get the shelf in this video. But our luck is not good today, so we're not even going to attempt it. <laughs> but we're gonna set up the bed so that it's nice and cute and cozy. bedroom um i don't think we did anything yesterday right nothing yesterday so no. it's been two days since we've seen you and our diy project is about to go down and i'm so excited because i have a vision and i think it's gonna happen we'll see. <laughs> um neither of us are like very used to building anything oh my gosh don't you don't you do that to me I'm a master. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. Michael can make anything work. Even if it's his first time, he he does figure it out. Um, I just mean that like we're not consistently doing yeah. projects, you know? Um, but <laughs> we did some YouTubing, we did some Googling, and I'm going to show you what we're about to do. All right, so like I've shared before, obviously I feel like the statement piece of this room is this back wall because it's just so big and giant and it's like the first thing you see when you come in here and the bed's up against it. So we're gonna do a DIY floating shelf right above our bed centered in the wall. Um, and I have just this cool vision for like putting a mirror and some artwork and some plants and stuff, stuff up there so that it just really pulls the whole room together and so we bought a piece of wood <laughs> this is a it's 10 inches wide one inch thick six feet long and then we have some screws i have no idea all we can like type this all out on the screen and then we have some black brackets somewhere um oh right here black bracket things we got five of them we're hoping every two feet we can put one it's just so that it's super stable but here we go That was a that was a task. So apparently, we learned on Google that most new apartment buildings that have walls sharing with the other units, they have um, like sound dampening in them. And what it looks like is instead of studs running this way, they still do, but then there's a bunch that run vertical or horizontally, and so it find, makes it really really difficult to find the studs. So. The stud finder was not finding our studs. So we eventually had to do was just put some drywall anchors in and run it that way. 
which I always hate doing. I'd rather go to the stud, but we figured it out and it is done. So Cheyenne's idea has come to life. So yeah, what do you think? I'm very excited. It's exactly what I wanted and I'm so excited to just get to decorate it, but we already threw a couple planks up there. <laughs> but I just feel like it's gonna totally just complete this little space. Mm -hmm. All right, see friends, it has been a little bit of time, but we have finally finished every little bit of this room and I am so excited to show it to you officially. Um, so let's go ahead and check out the completely redone, super dreamy boho bedroom of my dreams. <laughs> I am completely obsessed with how this all came out. Um, color scheme is like on point. I love the rests um, and the greenery with all of the plants is like just everything. I'm so excited with how this room came out. So I wanted to say a really, really, really big thank you to Lull because literally the heart of where this whole room transformation started was because we wanted to upgrade our mattress to a king size mattress and Lowell has the best mattresses of my life. I've said before we have been sleeping on a Lowell mattress for almost three years now um, so when we wanted a new mattress we knew like hands down we want another Lowell. Um, some of the things that we freaking <laughs> love about it is that it's actually so it's memory foam first of all so it's gonna like form to your body and keep your spine nice and safe and relieve all of that pressure but also it has a gel top coat that pulls heat away from your body so in the summertime like right now um it's amazing because it's going to not make you super hot as you're sleeping um, and it distributes the motion because of that memory foam. Um, I share on Instagram, but I definitely, definitely have sat coffee on my mattress and it doesn't like tip over or move because it distributes the motion evenly across the whole mattress. So we absolutely freaking love our little bed and I'm so stoked because Lul has been so generous and they are offering you $250 off of your Lul mattress. So if you are thinking about getting a new mattress, if you just need a new mattress, um, check out the link in the bio because you can get $250 off of your mattress by using the link in the bio, which is really freaking cool. <laughs> All right, sweet friends, it is time for me to say goodbye and close this video out. I hope you enjoyed it. I absolutely love room transformation videos, so I hope you enjoyed watching this one. Um, I'm so happy with how our room has turned out. And if you liked this video, then go ahead and hit the like button. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe. I'd love to be friends. Um, and leave a comment down below if you want to know anything. Um, I will have everything that I can link linked down in the description um, so that you can check that out. But I love you so much and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day.